it's just the breaking of the um, other habit or the presence of the other habit that creates the impression that I need to get better at this. And as the other habit that takes us out of being falls away, we find that being is actually where we reside. Is there a progression? Let's say I want to learn tennis. So then I'm trying tennis, I'm doing tennis, I'm watching how I hit the ball, I'm getting feedback. And then when I'm really, really good, it's clear that I'm not doing tennis. But in the beginning, when I was learning tennis, and I was paying attention, and it feels like I'm doing tennis. Mm -hmm. So can you talk about that? There's that change that happens. Yeah. So um, the progression is this coming to know ourself, um, and it takes effort. Sometimes it feels like effort, like I'm doing this. I'm doing the inquiry, I'm doing the investigating, I'm doing the dropping into being. Um, and it's, it's just the breaking of the um, other habit or the presence of the other habit that creates the impression that I need to get better at this. And as the other habit that takes us out of being falls away, we find that being is actually where we reside. And it's completely natural, and it's not something that we have to work at anymore. It means that we can walk through life, allowing life to unfold exactly as it unfolds, without having to try not to react, try to accept. We just find that um, acceptance is our natural state. Acceptance is our true nature. Happiness is our true nature because happiness is actually the absence of non-acceptance. So our true nature is peace. And it's not a true nature that we have to keep or a function that we have to keep doing in daily life. If we had to keep doing peace, we just it, happening, yeah. it would be hard work. Yeah. Okay. But this process of um, investigating the um, mechanics, that is a process that at first seems like I am doing it. I, the doer, am investigating. At some point it becomes amazingly clear, wow, I'm not doing investigation, investigation is happening. And that shifts the investigation to a whole new level of e efficacy. H hugely so. It becomes um, uh, exponentially more powerful when a witnessing of investigation happens. So the investigation continues, and yet what we are is witnessing the investigation happening, witnessing the practicing happening. And eventually, like you say, you realize that tennis is your second nature, and in this case, it's our first nature. Mm -hmm. So we don't need to do anything. Okay.